So today I got a nice purple envelope again from OSH Park. Osh Park, I don't really know yet how to pronounce that. Uh, and this time we have more circuit boards, obviously. So this is version 2 of a uh, LED Maestro, LED Maestro project. <clears throat> this is just a redesigned board. Uh, here's version 1. So basically I was able to almost cut it in half uh, widthwise. I basically rotated the MOSFETs and uh, just rearranged a couple of the input and inputs and outputs. Um, so this board ends up costing about half the price of this, just sort of looking to the future. If I'm actually going to produce something with these, then that would be, uh, obviously it's best to get the price down. So the other advantage that version 2 has is that the I put the uh, output, um, excuse my fingers also, I still have some ink on there from the printer. Uh, but uh, anyway, I put the output over here on a separate edge from the input. That way, and I won't be using these. I'll be using a uh, plug style connector, which actually I do have one somewhere. Oh, here they are. So I wanted the output on a separate side because that way this can be facing out of the case that it's going in and it'll be easier to attach wires to it and then the rest of the board will be internal so but I won't be using these connectors although I really like them I was going to go with a easier to use um, connector and this is a surface mount obviously this does not go on this board but on version 3 um, I'll be using a 4 pin surface mount uh, so that the LED strip can just be easily plugged in like that. So that's the plan. Um, that's not until version 3 though. So for this, this one's just sort of still messing around and uh, a couple little upgrades. Alright, that's it for now. See you later.